Thank you. The member for Canning. Thank you, Deputy Speaker. Uh, I have spoken many times in this chamber calling on the former WA Premier, Mark McGowan, to fix our hospital system. And we now have a new man running the WA government. And it falls to a new Premier to answer these urgent pleas. Despite WA's economic surplus, our hospitals are broken. Labor's health care record in WA is a disaster. The Peel Health Campus, my local hospital, has one of the worst emergency waiting times in the nation. Just before Christmas last year, ambulance ramping hit an all-time high. The WA Labor government has repeatedly promised upgrades, but just a few weeks ago, the health minister confessed that these urgent improvements won't begin for another year. More excuses, more delays. And this, bring, this brings me to the new Premier, Roger Cook, who happens to be the former health minister. Many residents in the northern areas of Canning have shared their concerns with me about Armidale Hospital. When Roger Cook was health minister in 2021, there were reports of 30 desperate patients queuing in the street outside for hours before they were finally let into an overcrowded emergency department. The same day at Armidale Hospital, an elderly man struggling to breathe in the crowded ED was left in a corridor and told no beds were available in the hospital. At the time, former Australian Nurses Union boss Mark Olson said overflowing hospitals, patients in corridors and nurses not being backfilled on sick leave had become the norm. He stressed that the state's healthcare system was the worst level he had ever seen. All of this under the watch of the man who is now the WA Premier. Rockingham Hospital in the nearby electorate of Brand is also no stranger to WA's Labor's <coughs> hospital mismanagement. In 2016, the year prior to the election of WA State Labor, ambulance ramping was at a total of 509 hours. In 2022, after nearly six years of labor, ramping has exploded to 4,284 hours. That's a total of 177 days that patients spent waiting to get into the emergency department and into a bed. The crisis in our health services runs far and wide. In the words of the WA AMA President Dr Mark Duncan, Dr. Mark Duncan Smith, WA may be the richest state, but our health system is the sickest. My concerns do not lie with our dedicated nurses, doctors and hospital staff. They consistently go above and beyond, often in challenging circumstances. We are blessed to have some of the best healthcare workers in the world but they need the best resources to provide the best possible solution and care for our community. When Mark McGowan resigned, he said, the truth is I'm tired, extremely tired. In fact, I'm exhausted. A nurse told me the other week that there's a meme going around WA hospitals uh, and they put that up reflecting their own state of mind. They are tired and they need more support from the WA state government. It's all within the power of one man, Roger Cook, the new premier, and I'm calling on him to deliver better health services for our the state. Member for Fremantle. 